Never gonna guess how much I spent on this vintage haul. Yeah, I'm gonna ask you to guess. So oh, Coca-Cola, guys. I feel like this should have had a mate, but that is one serious spork. Occasionally, I do pick up utensils. Some of these with Bakelite and some of them with a faux finish. And, and, and I never pass up a good masher. This one might surprise you a little. There's a bunch of random hardware on top. That's not the surprising part. Look at this guy. I'm so excited about him. Okay, I totally know he is not vintage, but I can't wait to put this on a little post and put hands sanitizer in it for like our vintage rental trailer and i got this set of grape dishes i did get the other guy they were briefly separated but they have come to an agreement this one also probably not so vintage but i have ideas for this he needs a trophy i have one for you i mean because i've told my family at times i need a trophy for yeah just life look at this lovely piece and i'm not sure what these were for but i'm guessing an old stove but yeah you can't pass up cast iron goodness at least i got this dangerous looking thing. Anybody know what it is? There's more artwork. I love finding old prints. This one is especially good. Those are kind of spectacular. All right, you guys, now comes the fun part. Guess how much did this cost? I can't wait to read the comments and see what you think. Ooh, let's do our thought for today. Time stands still best in moments that look suspiciously like ordinary life. Thanks so much for hanging out. It's almost Christmas. Get those mystery boxes and yeah, come back tomorrow. We'll do it again.